Why to the Olo, everybody? It's the man, the myth. The Legend Quad MFT here, and in today's video, I'm going to be bringing you guys a little bit of a controversial video, or at least a controversial topic. I think controversial is a word. I'm actually not quite sure, but we're going to be talking about the simple fact of why I prefer Infinity Ward Call of Duties over Treyarch. Now, the first thing is, Infinity Ward, I feel like they're a lot more fast-paced, and I feel like they have a lot more replayability. Now, don't get me wrong, Black Ops 1, that was a good COD. You know, I played it a little bit into the, about the August territory, which is a really long time to last for Call of Duty but let alone Modern Warfare 3 I have played that till the day end literally the end the, the last day that you could play before Black Ops 2 came out the night before Black Ops 2 came out I was rolling in Modern Warfare 3 parties honestly Modern Warfare 3 I still play this game that's why I have a series and that's why this is part of the series called Modern Warfare 3 Moab Mondays now it's not Modern Warfare 3 Moab Mondays but it has to be Modern Warfare 3 Moab Mondays because you can't really get a Moab in uh, in any other Call of Duty besides Modern Warfare 3 so I do really think that Modern Warfare 3 was my favorite favorite Call of Duty. In fact, I know it was my favorite Call of Duty, but I, I have to say that the reason why I, I really prefer it and why I prefer Infinity Ward over Treyarch is how it's so fast-paced. The connection always seems to be really rocking. The colors are really good, especially in Modern Warfare 3. In Modern Warfare 3, most of the colors, you know, they were, they were kind of brownish, but a lot of the different maps actually had quite a few little bright reds, uh, occasional different bright greens and blues and stuff like that, but don't get me wrong. I, I say don't get me wrong so much, guys. I'm such a loser about that stuff, but Black Ops 2, it's a really colorful game, probably even a little bit more colorful than the Modern Warfare 3, but Modern Warfare 3, again, the one thing that I believe really matters to me is the replayability, because, because Modern Warfare 3 and Call of Duty in general, there's supposed to be a game that you're, be able to, that you're able to play over and over and over again, and... You know that that that's what I that's what I look for in a game. You know I don't just want to play just like the campaign of Modern Warfare 3, just six hours of it, and then just be completely done with the game. You know I want to be able to play this. I want to be able to put in like 20 days of playing time, something insane like that, where I just basically get sucked into the game. That's what I want. That's what I look for in a game. You know it's kind of weird to be looking for in in a game where you you where you want to see something where you want to see it try and take over your life. Now that's a good game. When a game comes out and it takes over your life, something like World of Warcraft or something like uh, even for some people, Black. Black Ops 2 Zombies. I know Black Ops 2 Zombies can easily, like, uh, quote unquote, take over your life, but for me, I want to see a, a Call of Duty multiplayer do that, and I want to see COD Ghost do that. Now, COD Ghost being created by Infinity Ward, I really do think, if it was made by Treyarch, you know, it'd be really nice, but I do think Infinity Ward Call of Duties really have that opportunity to really get me sucked into the game. Now, I like I said, I want to be sucked into the game. I want to be able to just, I don't know, I just want to be able to be a part of the game. I want to be the game, and that's why I'm so excited for COD Ghost, because it's going to be made by Infinity Ward, so hopefully you guys did enjoy this awesome Moab gameplay. I was playing a little bit of solo domination. I'm sure you guys all know that. You guys know what game I'm playing on, what map, and all the guns, and the crazy overpowered OC OCR, ACR with the golden camo, but it's been Quantum FT. Hopefully you guys enjoyed my phone going off like six times in this commentary. It's been Quantum FT. I said that already, and I'll see you in the next video. Caught up in this dream world, getting used to life Hanging with the wrong people can keep you from doing right So I keep my circle tight, homie, you can never penetrate If your mind state is just a hate, you should renovate Do some mental feng shui, boy, I'm hella hungry I never play it safe like a touch base It's enough fuck face, open your damn eyes If ignorance is bliss, then they feeding you damn lies I'm never giving bad vibes, homie, you just add size Always do it big, like Rosie O'Donnell, pants size That's a joke, that's a joke, man, I'm a comedian Fuck swags and cheap trucks, is probably what you'll see me in Shitty cost up